splash. <laughs> Look at my head! I can't. Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Mob Impressions Gameplay Edition. Today we're gonna be trying out Bass Base Master Bass Master Base Master Fishing 2022. I want to thank the devs and publishers Dovetail Games for the review copy. We're gonna try the game out for half an hour to an hour, and I would love to know your guys' opinion. Would you play this game? Is this something you would buy? Right off the bat, you can see from the Steam page, mostly negative. The game came out uh, two days ago as of recording on the 28th. So, hey, we're going to try it out for ourselves. And then we're going to come back to this at the end of the video and see some of the reviews. Why are they negative? It could be because the game is complete trash. It could be some performance issues. Maybe there are some crazy features not in there that they wanted. So, I am not a, you know, base master Fisher Pro, all right? I know nothing about these games. However, I do enjoy fishing in games, you know? St uh, Stardew Valley, Arc Arena of Time, you know? Sega Base Fishing for the Dreamcast. All right, let's get started. Uh, <laughs> this is it. All right, so let's practice. You can customize your avatar. Yeah, well, let's see how much you can customize. Body size. Uh, oh, okay. Yeah, that's pretty cool. Look at all the different types of uh, freaking fishermen you can max. That's cool. Oh, these are actual like, like these are like licensed likenesses, huh? And then we got some uh, just basic heads and stuff. Oh, that's tight. All right, I'm gonna be Takumi Ito. <laughs> I wonder how, oh damn, Buddy Gross or Gross? Hell yeah, dude. Go practice tournament, practice or tournament. Uh, okay, what's the, oh. I just started. Uh, tutorial, please. My mouse is in the way. Lay of the lake. Okay, let's try this out. I don't know. Did I jump into the Welcome tutorial? Welcome to Dovetail Games oh. Bassmaster Fishing. Yay! I'm in. The official video game of bass. Eighty percent GPU usage. The by the way. Of competitive bass Why is it so much you put you usage? You put. Oh my god. Cool. Dude. Now look at my. Your boat. Have a look oh my lord. And get comfortable. This boat will soon feel oh like your my. second home. Thanks. Please drive the boat. I'm going to move my camera down a little bit here. I'm covering just a couple of the information here. All right. So we have a uh, water depth, temperature, how fast we're moving. Uh, press to drive the boat. You know what's weird? Okay. R RT. How come my, uh, my shirt or my jacket isn't rendered? Is it supposed to be that way? Dude, this game's killing my GPU. Oh my god, no, unoptimized like already. Behind the wheel of that that's that's not good. Nice work. Let's find a spot where the bass are gonna. Be. I think the driving is pretty fishing. okay. Move to the waypoint. Sure, sure do. Can you change anything? Let's see. Okay, I'm gonna change this guy. Oh god, this is like, look at that. It's just stuck at sixty. It's ultra. But the game still looks like garbage. <laughs> Let's put it on medium. Let's see how good that looks. All right, so I was running at 80%. It looks the same, by the way. And we're now running at 50%. Okay, so we dropped it down 30%. That's good. If you guys are wondering, I'm running a 2080 card. Let's go. Yeah, it looks the same. I can't tell the difference of what it was on Ultra or not. <laughs> All right, I'm here. Teach me. Oh, 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 there's more. That's not out. Uh, that's not far enough. Yeah, buddy, gross. Woo! You know, whenever I like go over ESPN, I don't really see a lot of fishing stuff. I wonder how often um, it's on like the television. I see like, uh, you know, golf, tennis, no oh, fishing. Is it seasonal? No, if, if you catch fish all year round, dudes. I don't know. All right, anyway, teaching us how to drive, pretty cool. They should just turn this through a wave race game. Look at the pop it. But then again, I am using the, you know, it is medium. The view distance is a little low. I, I'll give it that. I'll give it a pass on the graphics because I did turn it down to medium. However, that doesn't excuse you Ultra for being extremely unoptimized. 
Once your boat has slowed down and come to a I'm start. really interested in seeing why people hate it soon. Let me go check out the Steam this page again. Looks good. Why is this my shirt not rendered? You've been looking for. When you're ready, let's make a cast. <laughs> my butt, Mobby, that's how it really looks. LT. Hold RT to start your casting. Release at the desired level. Okay. Let's go to... Uh... Oh, overpowered. Where's the lore? I thought I got stuck in the freaking sky. See that thing dangling at the end of your line? That's called a lure. Oh. And it's a key piece of equipment <laughs> to use to attract a fish. <laughs> what am I doing? A lure can attract a fish at all times. Go but on. it's far more effective when moving through the water during your retrieve. Yeah, 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 yeah. There are a few different retrieval techniques. But for now, let's start with the basics and perform a consistent retrieve. Do this by reeling in at a consistent rate. Retrieval movements mimic how prey and bait move through the water. Combine that with colors and materials of different lures, and you'll impact your chances of getting bites. Thanks. You can also control how deep some lures move through the water by increasing or decreasing your reel speed. Okay, thanks. LT to reel. I'm reeling it. I'm holding it down. Oh, there it is. I... I I can't move the camera around. Can you believe me? Can't move the camera. You're stuck on this. Like two. Where am I? How far is it down? Oh, I see. It's on the bottom left. Splash. <laughs> Look at my head. I can't. First of all, it doesn't render all the way. My jacket. Now my care. Okay. All right. We're back. Bass. Ma base master fishing. By the way. Oh Don't my. Get disheartened. You're not going to get a bite on every retrieve. So cast out and retrieve again. Are you Remember, the longer your lure is in the water, the better chance you have of actually getting a bite. <laughs> Do people usually stand at the very very edge here? Well, I guess it's made for that. Right? I'm moonwalking with my untextured jacket. Here we go. 70%. Reel in. Oh, I got there one. Go. Hell the yeah. Bites, you want to set the hook and now we're playing mouth base master. In order to give you the best chances of not losing that fish during bass, the fight. Bass master. Do this by performing a strike. Am I going to punch the fish? Perform by quickly pulling the rod up and away from the fish's location. But the timing of the strike is very important. Perform too early or too late, and you're at risk of losing the fish. But mastering this timing is something you will improve over time. I hope. With practice. To strike, quickly pull the rod back. Fish lost. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> please. Please. Okay. All right, lure it in again. Ugh. They didn't say how you how do you pull it back? Do I use the left stick or the right stick? I'm pressing both, by the way. Uh, uh, that's a good looking fish right there. That's one good looking fish. Oh my god! Hello? Hello? I'm gonna reel it in again. Try again. Dude, what's going on? What's going on, dude? Come on, man. Reel that shit in. All right, ready? Okay. Are right, you ready? Come on. You ready? Okay. And... 89 passes. Pew! I still can't get over my jacket, dude. All right. To strike, quickly pull the rod back in the... Great. Now it's time to fight. The <laughs> I guess fish. I press both the, the hook has been the sticks. In the fish's mouth. It's going to do everything it can to get away from you. Your job is to make sure you bring it home. Thanks. Initially, fish will dart, run, or thrash while trying to escape, which is going to put more tension on your line and hook until the fish either breaks free or runs out of energy. But we can combat that by relieving the tension during the fight. Hell yeah. The tension system can be controlled through rod movement. Reeling, reel speed, and the drag system, of course, to increase or decrease the line tension as needed. 
Remember, you're also at risk of losing a fish if the line tension drops too low, which commonly happens once a fish becomes fatigued. Okay. So be observant of how the fish is behaving throughout the fight, as being able to recognize when and how you need to increase or decrease the pressure during the fish fight will have you catching more fish consistently. Okay. Move your rod to guide the fish in the desired location. I don't even know where the fish is. Am I guiding it right? Am I guiding it? Come on. So as you reel the fish I, closer to the boat, it's time to land the fish. If the fish's energy has been fully depleted once it's within grabbing distance, you can automatically land the fish. How do I know? Otherwise, you can attempt to grab the fish and land the fish. Where's early. the fish? Where's the fish's Grabbing stamina? The fish is all about the time. When initiating the grab action, a landing icon will appear to indicate the timing you need to match to successfully grab and land the fish. Okay. Successfully grabbing a oh. fish is a great way to land a fish faster, which can save you valuable time in a tournament. But it's also very risky, as failing to grab a fish will spook that fish and cause the fight to continue, putting you at risk of losing the fish. All right, here we go. Nice oh, I got cat. it. <laughs> You'll be awarded points and experience for <laughs> Look any at my fish arms. you catch. But this oh little bank runner isn't even the species we came what here to target. What is this? So let's release what it is and this? get back to fishing. This guy the, the, is a monster. Don't look at me like that. Freaking, what was his name? Buddy Gross? Yeah, Gross is correct, dude. All right, dude. I don't know. Stop. Stop. Just stop. Let's try a different equipment setup and see if we have better luck. Targeting bass. Oh, Your boat is rough. equipped with multiple rods and reels, so you can have many different rods set up and ready to fish at a moment's notice. Awesome. Open your inventory and let's see the rods we have in this boat. Different boats can hold different amounts of rods. Press wide open the inventory box. screen. Hey, this looks shows cool. All rod oh, loadouts. That are stored in tight, this boat. Tight. You can see a list of all the rods, and when one particular rod is highlighted. It shows you the full breakdown of its setup. Okay, cool. You can select and change any part of the oh. rod setup using equipment you already own, or you Ooh. can purchase new items and equip them. Okay. It's a great idea to have multiple different rod setups ready and waiting for use. That okay. way, you can quickly get your lure back in the water and change your tactics. I'm back to moonwalking now. Split second. For now, do I have do already do set do up do another do rod do for you. Do 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 select do the do second do rod. And let's try again. It's the second rod. Is it is it on? Oh. Okay. Cast. Long range. Fire. <laughs> I really hope his jacket doesn't have sponsors on it. <laughs> Cuz they'd, they'd be so pissed they can't even read it. How am I supposed to know where to buy my uh, my my fish tackle boxes and lures and and rods in the future if I can't read the back of Buddy Gross's back? <coughs> oh man! Is I wonder if it is just me. I'm reeling it. it. I, oh. Okay, don't panic. Huh? Getting snagged is just part of oh the fun of fishing. Oh my god! I got Especially caught on some seaweed. Those lunkers hiding in the cover. As you can see and feel through your rod movements. Your lure has got stuck. And we want to make sure it's free so we can get back to fishing as quickly as possible. By using the combination of rod movement, <sighs> reeling, reel speed, and adjusting drag, you can dislodge the lure from the snag. So just keep But don't go doing it all at the same time and don't do it too hard. If you snap your line due to too much tension, you will lose your lure and everything. No. If you want to save time, you can simply cut the line and re-rig or swap to another rod. Damn, and leave the freaking fishing wire in there. All right, I'm going to get it out of there. Come on, man. Come on. So literally, this is just like just, just messing with it. Wait a minute. Wait, what? Oh, I think there's a little mini game on the bottom left where it says snagged. It, the game didn't tell me anything about that. You just have to pull when it's green. I'm moving my sticks around. There you go. Once the game didn't tell me snag, about that. I, I just figured that out by looking at the thing. On your Getting snagged what? can be a real pain, 
And even if you've successfully freed the lure, guess what? You can get snagged again. I feel like I'm getting snagged by this guy's dialogue box. Oh, God. Oh, I'm going to get snagged. Hey, fish over here. Hey, come on. You want to eat this, don't you? Oh, it's back. I got snagged again. <laughs> you son of a bitch. All right, so you got to move the stick in a certain direction, then hold. Uh, oh, my Lord. And then hold reel. Reel in. Are there any fish in the water? What what what's the goal? Do I just catch a fish? All right. Hiya. <laughs> Some pitch. I right, try that again. All right. Boom! Ninety four. All right, here we go. Real that shit. Snag me. Come on, snag me. Constant. Oh, I got him. This is why we risk fishing around snag filled areas. Sure, there's a risk of losing equipment, but the payoff is getting bites of giant fish like this. Okay, you got this. Just like last time, let's bring this one home. It's going to take some more effort, though, as this fish is bigger, stronger, and even more aggressive. All right. Quick strike. Poor strike. Oh, you Keep bastard. your cool. You're getting close now. Remember. You can choose to grab the fish or wait for their stamina to run out to land it. Fish on. Landing chance. Oh, it's a cutscene. Oh, we have a freaking QTE. Boom shakalaka. <laughs> now that there is a wonker for I sure. shall go fish there. <laughs> you will get awarded more points and experience based on the size of the fish you All right, I understand. Is that the end of the tutorial? I think, I'm, I think I can go to the tournament now. Well, that's all the time we have for fishing today. Let's jump back into the driving seat of this boat and head back to the boat dock. Okay. You don't have to worry about how fast you're traveling back now. Oh, God. But it's worth being aware that when you're competing under yes. official tournament rules, you have to return to your initial starting point within a certain time to be officially weighed in and have your score count. Hey, I'm ready. Let's go. Failing to arrive back to this point at the assigned time will cause your final score to be deducted based on how late you arrive. Or even bum, bum, worse, bum, bum. if you arrive too late, bum, 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 you'll be bum, disqualified bum. and score nothing. So always keep fish over there. in mind what time it is and the distance you need to travel when competing. Drive into the assigned area to finish up here. Okay, X. Move to the waypoint. Driving. Here we go. 28 miles per hour, 32, dude, 36, 40, oh my god, 88 miles per hour, what's oh, top speed, 55, 55 is top speed, I like how you don't lose a single, a single ounce of acceleration moving left and right here, it's nice. Well, let's try a tournament out. I wonder how long it is. Oh, Jesus Christ. Bass fishing. Base. Is it base or bass? Base? Boom, 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 boom. Boom, 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 boom. Oh, gosh. All right, here we are. Let's see if that is the whole tutorial. Oh yeah, by the way, when I started the episode, that was it. That's the opening screen. Your character's avatar, and then practice or tournament. And That's there it. there we have it. A successful fishing trip. I had my doubts at points today. But you Your doubts. I, had my, I have my doubts now, all right? I know there was a lot of information to cover today. Not really. Some of which is going to take time to perfect and master. Still, you should be proud of yourself. As what you displayed today are the skills and techniques used by successful pro anglers. Well done. I'm proud Thanks, of Dad. you, and I can't wait to see you on the water next time. All right. Oh, here we go. We got to explore the water at your leisure. Career mode from the college series to base master classic online. Manage your character equipment and boat. Uh, stats and species. Track your progress through rewards and the shop. Well, that's neat.
Is the news? Who was Scott Martin? I don't know. Back to the Future. I just made a Back to the Future joke. That's funny. Let, 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 let's see what the. Uh, uh, let's, let's mess around with this. Oh. Oh. College series. They're sponsors. <laughs> Are these actual real sponsors? <laughs> <laughs> oh shit! Guess what, dude? I, I can't read your freaking uh your stuff on my on my jacket. Man, you gotta manage your freaking brands in this game. All right, let's get started. Take off. One round, seven uh, to half an hour, seven uh, seven a.m. Oh no! Go fishing. So this is the game? They give me Welcome half a the Bassmaster College series event. Oh no. Our anglers are ready for takeoff. Oh so let's no. join them on the water. They say career mode, but it's more like just stages, isn't it? I'm buddy gross. So it's 30 minutes real time? So you, you just catch fish and then you, you come back? Is it one lake? I'm sure you get different lakes, right? Like different areas? Right? So, where's the, you know what? I'm gonna just try, try to the end. How am I supposed to know where the best fish is? The top left? I'm just gonna keep driving. So there's no other, uh, there's no one else on the boat? Oh, let me, let me, let me smash this. Boom! Nothing. So there's no other players that you can see walking around. You know what game got fishing better? Shenmue 3. Shenmue 3 had pretty okay fishing. Alright, well, let, let me try to catch something at least. How about that? I think you might be able to, like, there's some fish here. Alright. Let's do this. Basic cast control, total cast control. Give me the total, man. I know, bitch. All right, that's my loadout. All right, here we go. So, shit! I don't think there's any fish here. I'll have to try. Oh. <laughs> Come on, man. Come on. Come on. Oh, my God. This is what the total does. It gives you control using the right stick over this. You guys want to see why there's negative reviews? Hold on. I'm going to look at this. All right. Let's, let's, let's look at this. All right. So, unfortunate. Let's see what's going on with this game. <sighs> okay. Well, the lure presentation is horrible, the blades don't spin, bait fish behavior is not realistic, and more, I've seen more realistic fishing on a 1990 Sega base fishing game. This is a money grab, nothing else. <sighs> half of what should be present in the fishing game isn't present, and half of what is present isn't working or is complete garbage. Game looks and runs very poorly. It runs really poorly, I have to agree. Um, looks like a 2013 game. Very little customization. I've seen better ones in a Super Nintendo. Only male. No beard. Ah, I did see a female. Model, that is. No beard. If you've got hair, it goes over your hat. No first person. A simulation game without first person. Is it a simulation game? No servers for online and no ability to host peer-to-peer. -peer. I get it. It's day one. There's always issues with online. If only there was one. No options for controls. Less than one minute in the tutorial, game freezes, can't do anything. One of the lamest menus. Finally, Dovetail Games, you are on my never buying a game from you again list. Hey, this guy played for only what, 20 minutes? This guy played for 13 hours. All right, let's check this guy out. Okay, I'm up to 12 hours. Uh, I've, all the, uh, I've done the, all the fishing simulators, Dovetail Games, and have over a thousand hours on Fishing Sim World. Pro Tour, here's my review. Oh, snap, here we go. Uh, it's, okay, it's, oh god, his review's too long. Uh, Jesus Christ. Alright, we'll just go over really quick. 
At the time of writing, uh, the deluxe edition items are now working. They, they, they know there's bugs. Uh, one new mechanic called snagging, <laughs> new mode, Bassmaster Royale. Oh, freaking Royale mode. That's pretty neat. It's a mastery system. Game looks stunning. Uh, okay, dude, they're just, uh, choice of 30 or <laughs> 60 FPS. If you can handle it, go to ultra. <laughs> oh God. Not a single crash or freeze. Uh, yeah, okay. Deluxe packs. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Offers a lot of choice for fishing equipment. There's no microtransaction. Well, that's a big plus. I would have to say that's a big plus. At the very least, right? There's a whole range of catch, uh, fish to catch, blah, blah, blah. One thing's missing is the fishing league. Uh-huh. My advice is explore single player mode, get fishing, earn some base bu bass bucks, get some stuff, and then sponsorship system is built into the game. Product refunded. Two hours. Gave it a shot. Audio cuts when you look at the map. No fishing lure animations. No one underwater cam shows many fish stuck unable to move. Very clumsy. Textures are bad. Post graphics are bad. Water is bad. Multiplayer is non-functional. Deluxe items. It's really hard to, you know, it's very crazy to see that. This guy had 15, 13 plus hours in it. Oh, man. I don't know, guys. Well... It, okay, I'll, t I'll tell you, even if I was a crazy large fishing fan, I wouldn't get this. I would not recommend it if I was a big, big large fishing fan. It just doesn't uh, look that great. Of a g you know, I don't know what other crazy fishing games are out there, but I don't know, man. I feel like it could have been more done. It's a little weird. But hey, maybe I'm just being ignorant here. Um, for those of you who are into... Bassmaster Fishing. Let me know what you think. Are the reviews correct? Have you tried it yourself? Let me know. I would really, really like to know your guys' opinions. Uh, I think that's it for this one, though. I'm, I'm done. So, thanks for watching. I'll see you guys next time. Bye.